also new at noon, Indian River State College is getting a $4 million grant. Governor Ron DeSantis announcing the award this morning in St. Lucie County. And this will go towards developing a new ballistics focus center. Our Josie Carbonari is live in Fort Pierce. And Josie, this will help local law enforcement agencies as well. That's right. As you mentioned, that $4 million grant here at Indian River State College will go towards ballistics for law enforcement. Now, joining Governor Ron DeSantis during the press conference today, we had that check presented was Florida Commerce Secretary Alex Kelly and Indian River State College President Dr. Timothy Moore. The new Ballistic and Emerging Technology Center at Indian River State College will be in charge of building, designing and testing ballistic materials like glass doors and walls for law enforcement use on patrol cars, for example. A company by the name of Diamond Defense Systems will partner with Indian River State College to make this happen. The governor says workforce education and training is needed in supporting local small businesses and promoting innovation as well as training that is marketable. This is something that I think is um, right in our wheelhouse for as, as the state of Florida because what the center is going to be able to do, students are going to learn skills they need to make ballistic assault barriers, including bulletproof glass, walls, and doors. So we uh, pride ourselves on being a law and order state. And a timeline for when this will all happen has not been announced yet. Reporting live from Fort Pierce, I'm Josie Carbonari, WPBF 25 News.